Hey everybody, Dave here. I'm doing a follow-up for my last video involving Aero not being on demand. A couple days ago I noticed that on my uh, Comcast Xfinity On Demand service, Supergirl, The Flash, and Legends of Tomorrow are currently available on demand, but Aero isn't. Now, I asked people on the Twitter uh, to check out their own providers and see if it's available there. So far, I've gotten some interesting confirmation. Not only are other Xfinity uh, customers checking it out and com confirming that it's not available for them either, so it's not just my area, but it looks like Time Warner Cable, Cox Communications, and even Verizon Fios customers are all noticing. The other three shows are there, but Arrow isn't. Now, I know that coming up on Season 5, they're going to be dealing with the 100th episode, and that means it's going to be syndication money. It's possible that the show might simply not be available due to some kind of contract renegotiations and restructuring for more cash. But you know what it tells me? It tells me that the comic book fans that hate the way that Laurel Lance and the actress that plays her, Katie Cassie, the way they were, that they were mistreated and effectively discarded will not be tolerated. It means that people are making their voices heard, and the fans of the comics who love these characters are no longer going to be considered the silent minority. So please, spread the word. I'm currently waiting to hear more back. Someone said that it's not available on Hulu, and I'm waiting to get more confirmation back on that. So, please, if you have any kind of cable or on-demand or online service that has on-demand, check to see if Arrow is available, but if the other three shows that are connected to the Arrowverse are The Flash, Supergirl, and Legends of Tomorrow. If they are then the show that started it all being missing is one hell of an omission. And it tells me the comic book fans are making their voices heard and winning. No Laurel, no Arrow. Please, keep up with the word here. You see anything, let me know. Pass it around the Twitterverse. And uh, let the people at uh, DC Comics and the CW know what you think about all this. Is it just some kind of weird fluke that Arrow isn't on demand? Is it some kind of restructuring thing? Or does it mean that the comic book fans have had it with Mark Guggenheim's crap? You tell me. Peace.